Previously, I was an Android user, so handling images, videos, ringtones and songs was a super easy task. But after I switched to iPhone, everything became more difficult. Even though iPhone come with a larger storage space like 64 or 128 GB, it's not enough for us to store all our images, videos and songs. Additionally, to secure our photos and files, we have to copy them on our PC or Mac. When you sign up for iCloud, you will get 5 GB of free storage. If you need more storage, you have to pay for that. Therefore, the best solution to pack up your files is to transfer them to a PC. Apple provides a free app called iTunes to transfer your files between iPhone to PC or Mac. However, nowadays they stop providing too much attention to developing this app with modern UI and easy to use functionalities. I think it's not a perfect and easy to use solution for handling iPhone files. Whenever I use iTunes, I'll get stuck like this. When you get something free, you can't expect so many features and easy to use functionalities. Sometimes iTunes gets stuck and gives a really frustrating experience. Most iPhone and iPad users hate using it for file transfer and I'm no exception. You can simply do the Google search and see the evidence. If you're new to iPhone, you'll definitely become confused when using iTunes for the first time, primarily due to its library and device sections. You will get confused which one do you have to pick for file transfer and file handling. So what is the best solution to handle your iPhone files from PC or Mac? The answer is use a third party iPhone iPad manager like Winnex Media Trans. Recently I had the opportunity to use Winnex Media Trans. Wow, I think it's a wonderful solution for handling your iPhone files. I'm not saying this to promote the software. I'm genuinely experiencing a lot of benefits using it. Winnex Media Trans is an easy to use file transfer and file manager app for handling file transfer between iPhone and PC. To try out the software functionalities, first download or purchase the software using the links provided in the video description or pinned command. After that, install the software on your computer. Then connect your iPhone to your computer using a USB cable and open MediaTrans app just like you would open iTunes. Your iPhone will ask you to trust the PC or not. Say yes. That's all. Now your files will be listed in MediaTrans. On the MediaTrans app homepage, you can see various details about your iPhone like its actual storage, the available storage space, battery percentage and current iOS version. Don't underestimate the app's capabilities based on its homepage size. When you click on any one of the options in the app, such as photo transfer or music manager, it will expand the screen and show all available options to managing files. It offers numerous features like photo transfer, which allows you to handle and transfer photos between your iPhone and PC. If you use the music manager option, you can add new music or editing exiting music informations such as artist, album. You can also create new playlists and add songs using drag and drop method. After you added or edited something, simply click the sync button. That's it. The file modifications will be added on your iPhone. It has so many features, so I'll explain everything as quick as possible within a minute. The video manager option allows you to add new videos or export exiting videos. You can even export your videos with encryption. So anyone who wants to view those videos will need to enter the password. The app also provides an encrypt file option which allows you to encrypt and decrypt multiple files and folders simultaneously. The book option allows you to manage PDF, EPUB and audio books on your iPhone. Additionally, it provides the functionality to export your EPUB book as PDF or HTML or text file. So you don't need to install another software on your system for EPUB file conversion. Using the voice and ringtone option, you can add new ringtones, edit mp3 files and convert them into a ringtones. Additionally, you can use your iPhone as a flash drive and remove DRM protection from your purchased music. Now let's discuss how to transfer photos from iPhone to PC. First, click on the photo transfer icon. It will list all available photos on your iPhone. You can see how many photos are available on your iPhone and its total size at the bottom of the screen. Select the photos you want to transfer to your PC. If you want to export all photos, Simply tick the select all option or select one of the photo and press the Ctrl A shortcut key to select all photos. Then click the export button. 
Once it exported or transferred that image to your system, it will open the folder containing that file. You can change the default path for exported items in app settings if you want. With just a single click, you can export, transfer any photo from your iPhone to your PC. If you want to upload new photos, simply create a new folder and place the photo inside it. Then click the sync button. If you want to use this product, you can find the download link in the video description and in the pinned comment. I hope you enjoy this video. I'm going to see you in the next video. Bye bye.